Last album was too pop for who I am. It was a hard lesson to learn. Because as an artist, I do owe it to my fans to give them what it is they need from me. This is my fifth album, so we're at a crossroads. I always feel pressure to come through, to never fall short. For me as an artist, I have one option. Make it right, or there will be no album this year. I came to New York to have a meeting with Larry Jackson. He's the a and of my project, the heartbeat between me and the company that's my home, J Records. We gotta see where we at. It's a lot of artists up here, and it's a lot of artists that have sold a lot of records. Mm -hmm. Where in that equation do I fit in? It's gonna be incumbent upon you to really seize the moment of being up here right now. And admittedly, there was a bit of a fumble last time. You know what I mean? Things happen the way they're supposed to. And you get back in the game, you just play hard the next go-round. This is the next go-round. What's up? How are we looking, man? We're just talking about, you know, the the, um, the objective for the album. And the objective is, is clearly to just, you know, not to make records that are, are flashes in the pan or trendy little ditties, you know what I mean? But yeah. Records that, you know, have some depth lyrically and that are copyrights again, you know what I mean? You, whatever you're thinking, make sure that tonight we talk again so we can make it all happen. And that way, as soon as I get off the plane, we could just link up. Just call me and get this video. I'll be there. Okay. All right. All right, bye. But I think we're now speaking the same language with respect to what it's going to take for you to really reconnect with that fan base in earnest. I'm not going to bring you records that I don't believe in. I won't even bring you those to even create confusion. Like, everything I bring you, I'm going to make sure that I sing it to the best of my ability. I'm going to make sure that every every single word makes sense. I, I'll make sure it's right if you feel like we can really make it happen in all of us. The trend has leaned a little bit more R&B and a little less hip-hop, and, you know, that's created uh, a really clear lane for you as an artist to come back and, and win. Last album, the label decided we go with a record that I didn't believe in. We disagreed but we folded. We had too many hits over the years to come to this point and disappoint the fans ever again. That's not acceptable. It's not gonna happen. It's either do or die. No matter what I got going on, that's not my children's issues. Being a mom is my greatest accomplishment yet. I've never felt the kind of love that I felt after having my children. But my two sons, Rocco, Romello, I experienced it. And it's scary, but it feels real, real good. I'm stressed because the pressure's on me. You know, everybody in the world knows I'm not producing this album. We got a lot of haters out there, too, that want to see this fail. My primary goal is to get the job done, period. I called this meeting today, uh, really, because you guys know I'm, we're doing a Monica album, and basically have a bulk of it done, actually, like, what we feel like is a good body of work, but now we're trying to bring it home with the singles and with, uh, you know, just the urgent record. We've all been working kind of separately, but I just kind of want to get everybody in one room on one accord. And as you know, we've been making records. We just cut a record I produced with Donnie the other day that I think is incredible. So we got the story, now we need the hit. Single. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> we got the story, now we need the jump off. Like, we got what I think would be a second or a third record, a third single. Um, we need one and two, you know what I'm saying? Like, bona fide, like, yo, okay, this is, what are we doing? I don't want the label to have no questions. We, we, we turn Monica around, 
it'll change the face of what we're doing, you know what I'm saying, as a unit. Because it opened up the floodgates. They'd be like, yo, the team came on in and did what they had to do. You know what I'm saying? So we just need to do that. Dallas is always honest with me, and his opinion is the highest on my list. He was the one that discovered the little girl singing the greatest love of all, so I need him. Melinda is my first cousin, and she's also my manager. 15 years ago, she dropped everything, quit her job, and took a chance on me. I can't do what I do without her. When you think of me, you would think of substance to a certain degree, but that doesn't really happen when you're working with producers. You know what I'm saying? So. With you knowing that from the first time you met me, it's like, what's the disconnect? The industry lost their gut feelings, all right? Like, Picasso don't ask people what color to paint with. Gucci don't ask you what bag to make. They make it and tell you this is what we do, we're experts. The industry got so gutless that they start saying, well, let's ask America what they want. Mm -hmm. And your label is built out of this, let's ask America what they want. They don't know what they want, all right? So you're a genius when you go back and say, I'm doing me. And then they go, wow, how did that happen? When CeeLo stopped doing Goody Mob records, it's because he didn't want to do Get Rich to this no more. He's like, that's not us. We were saying something, all right? So as soon as he did Crazy and all that, and all the Broccoli record, he went, went through the roof because CeeLo is just doing him. He's just doing what he does. Andre, when they did Love Below, everybody's going, wow, we don't even know how they created the Hey Y'all Speaker Box. Because they're not paying attention to you is how they did it. They're doing what they got to do to feel like outcasts over here. I'm going to be honest. I don't know what people want from me right now. I'm just trying to figure, figure out, can I just be me? Let me just do that. Well, you got to get your confidence back to that point of saying, this is what I'm doing. Um, you know, everybody go figure it out. I mean, I, I needed to hear what you had to say because I needed to refocus. Because sometimes it's right. It, it's in my head. But me making somebody else understand it. It's really hard, and I think it's just because instead of thinking about it, it should just come out my mouth because it's coming from my heart. You mean you filter it now? <laughs> I have filtered it a lot. I have filtered the mouth a lot. I, I think it came from... You're growing up. Girls don't act like you. Girls don't act... But they do, just not in your world. Yeah. So... Yeah. You just matured. That's all. You grew up. I'm filtering too much. I need to lift the filter just a bit. Just remember you said it. When my grandmother passed, my mother never wanted the traditions that we had to stop. Our whole family, we're real close, and we eat together at least one day a week. Hey, hey, homes, what's happening? Y'all come on in and get comfortable. We're ready for you to bless the food if you don't mind. Well, wait one second. Before you bless the food, I want to say thank you to everybody, not just for coming today, but it is difficult. We, you know, with our jobs, me and Rodney, we gone, but we know our kids are in good hands. That your love and your prayers keep us safe. I, I also want to tell the producers, thank you. You don't always get a second chance, and I got a second chance, you know what I'm saying? We may have disappointed some, but not many. So we got an opportunity to really do it big. And I just want to say to my mom, thank you for being there and taking care of the kids here in and out of town. And I love everybody. And I'm not sad. I'm happy because I did something that a lot of people thought I couldn't do, whether it was after my children or in my losses or with who I love. And right now, I thank you for making sure that we OK when you're home and when you're not. So everybody have fun and just know, even if I'm not telling you every day, that I love you and I got your back too. So y'all eat and have fun.
Introducing new Hershey's Chocolate Dunk. We got some hits coming, right? We got some hits coming. Gotta add a hit. How many hits on this album? Okay. Name the first hit. Name the number one hit. The single? The number one hit. Well, here's the deal. We don't have a single yet. Um, we, we, we have a body of work that I think is incredible. It's an incredible album. And we just need the first two. We don't have two. a single because Brian been playing me songs for somebody, uh, not me. <laughs> now, that doesn't sound like Brian. You see what I'm saying? That's what I said the other night. That's what I said the other night. I'll have y'all know that. As a creative person, sometimes it takes me a while. I would admit sometimes it takes me a while to get in the zone, but we're going we gonna to find it. We're going to find it. When I'm in the studio, I usually start pulling a bunch of percussion instruments and just get to dealing around with the bongos or with a bass drum or with a snare drum. Just whatever happens. And a lot of times, I, I keep creative people around me, too. What time Monica coming through? What are we, we going to do with her? From a single standpoint, I just thought, I mean, it's always pressure when you're trying to figure out what that, what that is. You know what I'm saying? Right. We have to create the right energy at the right time with the right record. I, I hope Monica's in a space to just, I mean, I know she wants to steer this thing, you know what I'm saying? She got to let me do my job. We're not in here play play. We in here creating. Just have to believe it. You know what I mean? It's hard to make a artist who set in their ways believe something different. Auntie. Yeah? Hey, how you doing today? I wanted to see if the boys could come and hang out with you. I'll be done at least by 11 o'clock. Whatever is more convenient for you, if it's a possibility. You know, I would love to spend time with those boys whenever I can and what time I need to be here. I'll walk out now. All right. All right, love you. Love you too. Bye. You gonna have fun with Nana? Give me love. Baby, hi. You come to stay with Aunt Tina. Mama be back on time. Yeah, we just walking in. Love you. What are we gonna do for fun? Mwah. Are we gonna play basketball? Mwah. What's wrong? He acting real sad. The Rock. Huh? What's the matter? She said she's going to work. Mama. Okay. What's wrong? Oh, Mama. You want to go with Mama? I'm going to work. I spend so much time with my children that I feel sick when it's time for us to separate. Oh, 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 You want to ride? Yeah. I promise I'll be right back. Oh, Come here. I take them everywhere with me when I'm traveling, but the one place I keep them away from is usually the studios. What up? Hello. Hey. How you doing? So, um, How are you? I'm good. I'm good. So, Mel, man, okay, I got a record I'm very, very excited about. I'm going to pre-warn pre you. It's a fast record, but it's a soulful record. You know what I'm saying? It need to be fast enough to play in the club, but slow enough that I ain't got to dance in the video. OK. Because that ain't going to happen. It's, it's the kind of record you don't have to dance crazy in the video, but it's a soulful record. Did we make any progress on getting that done? Yeah, I'm about to play for you right now, and then we can. Turn up.
Who was that? That was the joint I was talking about. Do you really feel like that record sounded like me? I don't. It's like, I, I almost thought you might have been playing something on somebody else that you just needed to, <laughs> like, listen to for a hot minute, because I know you uh, ain't think that I need to record that song. No, you got to trust me. Like, you hired me to, to produce the record. Like, we can't be going back and exactly forth. Exactly like I trusted somebody the last two times, right? <sighs> and that was wrong. Now, you didn't do that, so that ain't on you. But what I'm saying is, is if it does not work, B. Cox can move on and put a hit on somebody else, or he could flop with somebody else and still go try it again. See, you'll get a couple times, you know, ain't no training wheels on this bike over here. If I ride this thing wrong, it's a crash and burn. Like, I understand that you, 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 you put your trust in other people the last two times. But like you said, it, it ain't me. Like, like, you have to trust my ear. Like, that's what, that's what y'all hired me to do. I want to see something I'm 100% about. I ain't diddy bopping in the club four nights a week no more, none of that. Like, it's all got to be for real. Like, it's, that ain't, that just don't sound like it. It's like, I keep hearing these songs, they weird, they different, some of them sound like techno. Like, I can't do it, I can't do that. Give me a soul record with pop potential. You give me that, I promise you, I give you what it is you need for me. I just love the new shoes you bought me, Mom. They are so cool. I'm glad you like them. Troy, which ones do you like? It's back to school at Famous. Buy one pair, get another pair half off. Make today famous. Okay, I'm getting dressed right now. Tonight is birthday bash. That's one of the biggest events of the year here. Hold up! I'm going in support of Rocco. He comes alive when he's on stage, and I want to be there to see him. I just got an email talking about how all the lanes on 85 downtown is, like, totally blocked off. If we don't leave right like now... Yeah. No, no, you need to yeah. multitask, more yeah. real. You can be talking on the phone and getting dressed, too. Let's look. You find it. I mean, this is not brain surgery. I have shoes, jewelry, everything I'm bringing for Rocco in the car with me. Wow. And he goes on stage in exactly three minutes. Hey, Humza, we on our way, um, and we, like, really, really, really rushing. That's a problem. Does it seem like the show running on time? I need for you to stall them. It's a little traffic right here. Said they moved them up to 825. Oh, my I'm late. This not moving, Linda. I'm looking at traffic, looking like 15 minutes. Linda, we might have to do something a little off. So, got to do what I got to do. Got to get there. Step out, watch out. Okay, she coming. I got my husband clothes, and it is time for him to go on. Is there any way I don't care if I... Yeah, Rock, I need to get us him. He don't even have on a pair of shoes. because he's showing people that no matter what your life was like, you can achieve all your goals if you just go head first. He's definitely figured out how to balance family with that. So seeing him be concerned about us and our well-being at all times pushes me even more just to be there and just to hold him down. Trying to balance it. We gotta finish that record tonight. Man, for real? 
Give me an energy kiss. Give me some kiss for energy. Well, give me a kiss. Like give me a kiss. Man. Give me on fire. I got it. Mama got some energy. I'm gonna make it happen. I'm gonna make it happen. Oh, I'm gonna make it happen. I'm gonna make it happen. I gotta say it to believe it. I knew y'all weren't working. Oh. <laughs> I knew it. Zoom something. What's up, baby? What's going on? How is it today? It's good today, actually. I think that Monica's an incredible vocalist. She's a singer. And my goal with this album is to just not only push her with the songs, but push her vocally. Chinese girl in an elevator. Oh. Mm -hmm. Give me that act, give me that Elevator, elevator. That's it, though. Okay. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I just want to just want to let up. I, I, I like the attitude you put at the end, though. Mm -hmm. Just just keep, just, when you say just won't let up, uh, I kind of like that, that spirit you put on there. Just keep that up. Bro, you like this song? Like, mm. Then this song about how you playing it though. Like, like you said, man, you still working, you still mm. recording records. Nigga would be a second single, third single, first single. It's all about how you map it out. You know what I'm saying? Here's the you know catch, though. We gotta be second. done in a week. I mean, I've seen a lot of people get some of their best records in the last week. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Well, if they don't like it, they won't say I, I didn't sing it well. They just won't like it. <laughs> At this point, I'm not happy. I'm expecting something that I'm just not getting. So me and Melinda are going to New York to work with these producers named Stargate. I think this is going to light the fire back in Atlanta. It's trailed as national clearance of... Me and Melinda are going to New York to work with these producers named Stargate. I think this is going to light the fire back in Atlanta. Let's try one more time on that line and make it flow even better. That's a great way. Yeah, I think we're almost there. But if you think money makes me happy, you should come. I like it though. Yeah, love that. It's just a little more even. The session was crazy. Mikhail and I, chemistry was unreal. I can't wait to go back, let all the producers hear what had taken place. Really? It's time for us to turn it all up a notch. We don't have a single yet. 
So I'm not satisfied. But now cracking down on these outside writers to be as committed to it as we are. Now, the concept is, like I said, we want to make a record from a monica that's like a stronger, wise, you know, what don't kill me makes me stronger. It's from, from, from her perspective or just pe telling people, say this. Making something that's hers, but something that is... Everybody can, yeah. You know what I mean? Okay. Not so personal where it's like, they try to guess what she's talking about. Okay. But you, you want her to feel it, you know what I'm saying? Okay. So, um, I'm gonna play you the beat. What you feel? What's the first thought? A, a title like a still standing or something. Okay. You know okay. what I'm saying? Like. No, I get that. You see what I'm saying? I get that. All right. Mm. I was just vibe with it, man. Go ahead and get the, the vibe happening. Gotta get my vibe right. Vibe. <laughs> hey. Hey. It's. Uh oh. I got it, I got it, I got it. I got it. Yeah, I'm, I'm just going to do it. Uh, I guess I guess we can start at the first verse this time and stuff the hook. Right. Hey, boy, this, hey, this it right here, dog. Yeah. Oh, man, that's good right there, bro. Uh -huh. Yeah, that's it. That's exactly what I wanted to. What the, uh, what's up, yeah. Talking about, talking about Monica about walking in right now. We uh, talking about. You know what I'm talking about, folks? We were just talking about, like, how, you know what I'm saying? You just be keeping it real, folks. You know what I'm saying? Don't about... play with me. Don't, Don't play, play with me. <laughs> good job. Look, yeah. while, while we in good motion, no. I think I need to light a few more fires. OK. You know, I was in New York. Trying to get it all together. I mean, what you want to do? You want you want to play you some stuff. Oh okay. man, for real. Whatever. <laughs> Come on. All right. So, all I have to say is that um, I like the, I like the Stargate record. Um, but <clears throat> I think it's, I think we're working with something right here. The moment we've been looking for. I'm gonna play it. If you can't understand something that I said, just ask me. I'll tell you. Cause I know I got the mush mouth sometimes when I be singing. Is it what it sound like? Yeah, I think dude, we're really doing this. Oh, yeah. Say it loud so you won't be confused. 
about what we talking about I've been through the storm Had dirt on my name I'm still holding on A champion of the game They say Whatever do Can you make you stronger Well I must be the world's strongest woman See I done done a whole lot of doing Everything you're saying I'm already knowing Cause I I've been up against the boss Everything you're going through I've been having more See the mark Trying to tell you how it's supposed to be See, this is more than just a song for me Cause I I've been up against the rules Everything you're going through I've been in the See them all come and I see them all go But you can bet your last oh. And my head won't hit the floor Never I'm still standing 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 I'm still standing Yes, I am Yes, I am Standing Standing I'm still standing Adonis understands me. It's scary when somebody can feel your pain and translate that into your record for you. But that's exactly what he just did for me. Oh. Good job. Good job. Good job. Hey, let's get it cracking, man. With Metro PCS, you get unlimited local and long distance wireless plus unlimited text for $40 a month. And when you sign up now, there's no activation fee and your first month is free. Metro PCS. Hello. 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 I told you about the baller alert, right? What is that? I tell you about that? Uh -huh. They have a list oh, yeah. of ballers. Right. Groupies go on there, create their page. And Sometimes whenever there's a baller in town, a hot what happens mess. when there's a baller in town? It they alert get a text you? message That's on crazy. their phone. Cut it out. Like, people, hold on, hold on. So it's crazy. With the location. But, but exactly. <laughs> we, we, like, if you come you to the city. You should be a free aid test if, if you come to the city. Yeah, what's going on, what's man? Up, God? What's up, boy? What's going on, man? Sure, sure, sure. Right. Child love, too. <laughs> Chris. Cox. My dude. What's going on, What's up, man? baby? Hey. What's up, girl? No. I can't complain. What's up, brother? Good. Yeah. Y'all right? I'm absolutely, I'm good. Yeah, man, we just... Finally checking out the lounge. I'm like... I'm loving it, bro. Loving it, dog. It's hot. As long as we have been around each other, well, childhood, you know what I'm saying? We never did anything or tried anything musically. We always kept it, you know what I'm saying, personal. Like, we always kept... Strictly family. We always kept it strictly family, and I wanted to make sure we let you see and hear everything we got going on, cause you know one thing about it. I always get your opinion anyway, yeah, yeah, as yeah, whether yeah. you getting, whether you want it or not. I mean, people yeah. hear about me, but they don't really know me. You did, right. but mm -hmm. I want this mm -hmm. album to say that, and, and for it to be no confusion. That's what's gonna get into the hearts of the fans, cause you got your true Monica fans, and then you got people that know you've been away for a minute, and they just waiting for you to just smack them upside the head, honestly speaking. What do you feel you need to do in order to make that happen? Well, I think that we are halfway through the process of doing that. The whole record, like, it's all come together, and the last thing is going to be still standing. So... Look, if it's one thing I know, one of them tornadoes could come through Atlanta, Georgia right now. <laughs> out of anybody in this establishment, you still going to be standing. Like, you understand me? I believe that. Absolutely. Every single chance I get to do something with my children, that's what I do. Look right there. That's a zebra. You want one? Look, La Rock. Oh. <laughs> that's Kelly. Say hi. Oh. Girl. All right, easy. Take it.
can pet Don't us. Don't do it. Mm. Beak. You should show <laughs> him not to be afraid, like for real. Mm -mm. You scared? Mm hmm. All the gangsters scared of the wildlife. Beak. Wow. You took the record home and live with it? You already know it. Uh, all right, let me go grab Adonis. Nice and prepared, Ryan. And we can get this thing started. Yeah. Is it up, Sam? Grab, grab, indeed. Yeah. I'm here. Yeah. Adonis, you think I should sing this like my 95? That's what I was thinking when I was listening. Oh, 95. Exactly. No, I knew exactly what she meant. Exactly. Just play me the first line. I've been up against the ropes. Everything you're going through, I've been there before. Right there. I'm gonna try to. I'm gonna try to catch that. Wait a minute. I'm make my little note. I've been up against the ropes. Come on, bro. I've been up against the ropes. Everything you're going through, I've been there before. Run real quick. I'll be back in an hour. See y'all. I just read that lip say, I'll be back. Let's yep. talk. Where you headed? This I boy. My brother somewhere. Ah. Uh, ah, uh, ah. Uh. Nah. The hour. They got you. I'm coming right back. You need to get, let's get this song done. OK, yeah. so you, uh, yeah. I'll be back. I got you. Have fun in an hour. An hour. hour. That's all we need. That's all we need. We're going to ride the street. Don't get do too it. loose, Brian. One more time. One Thank more time. Thank you, babe. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, listen to me now. I'm gonna say it loud so you won't be confused about what we're talking about. I've been through the storm, had dirt on my name. Ooh. I'm still holding on, champion of the game. Thank <laughs> you, got that thing on you, man. Feel yes, that. sir. <laughs> yes, sir. Next one. Yeah. She oughta done a whole lot of going. Everything you say, I'm already knowing. Cause I ain't hey. the Yeah, that's perfect. That's perfect. Standing, 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 I'm still standing. Standing, standing. I had a lover take his own in front of me. I asked God, why is this happening to me? But I didn't go. I held my own. And now I'm deep in love with who I belong. They say with age comes wisdom And the white flag I can't give them Trying to tell you how it's supposed to be See, this is more than just a song to me Cause I I am extremely happy with the way the song came together. I think it's because we all found our ways as writers, as producers, as the artists. So I know that this song is gonna be a tremendous part of my album and a tremendous part of us creating this moment. Yes, sir. Okay, so we're Brian, because we need to kind of get the record mixed and because Monica part is pretty much done, so. No, we're Ain't good. no pretty much. I'm through. Where Brian at? This starting to me off about a second. Hello? Hey, hold on, Mo, won't you? What kind of games you playing? No, no. I lost my brother. I'm trying to find him right now. How you lose a grown man? See, that's what I be talking about. That that right there, that, that ain't gonna work. We already finished, so what I'm supposed to do? Way, Monica. How you on your way? You said you just can't find him. You remember we was talking about lying for no reason? This is a prime example. If your phone hang up, I swear I'll bust your windows when you pull up. <laughs> you know exactly what's going on. He probably standing right next to you. I ain't new to this. I'm true to this, baby. Where you at? How you on your way? You 
still looking for him. I'm gonna let my cousin look for him. You, so you saying you gonna leave him? Now, better yet, this is what I do. I leave y'all, and then you find me. This could be my last meal as a free man. Get back in that car. It hasn't been easy, but we did it. We did exactly what we set out to do. As a team, we created the music. We did everything that we agreed we would do. Now, it's up to J Records to do it again. All my uncles hut it up in one area. What you think? I mean, I think it was a great turnaround. I do too. Day one with Brian when we was a little shaky about the tracks, and then when. We went to New York, and you kind of gave him the heads up, and we came back, and he had the fire. You know, I just understand that it's hard to make other people see your vision, but that's my job as an artist. Yeah. And it's just something that I have to just continue to believe in me enough to do, you feel me? So I'm I'm very happy with what's taking place. Was I definitely haven't been there since day one. I see a huge difference in your overall control of the project. And I, I think the only thing that, like you say, that was missing was you explaining to them your vision. And when you got that part, I mean, it's just a no-brainer. Because everybody gets you now because you get you. So I think Take that's made... Take a minute to find yourself. Yeah, but I think that's been definitely what made the difference this time. Because everybody refers to you. Like, they wouldn't make a move on any of the stuff until they came through you. And I just think that's going to be the major difference in this project. I don't think it's a doubt that, you know, um, we don't have enough material to choose from. Now it's just come the hard part, going to be just choosing. I think this is definitely it. Well, everything I am is also because of you. I mean, you gave your life up for this thing, too. So we just got to keep it this way. It, it just always works when there's no outside party. So me and you got to do what we always said we do. Toughest warrior or the ultimate fighter Cause I'm the truth and nothing but it Like my hands on the Bible And this is survival of the fittest The realest is not a facade Still standing on my two feet Cause I'm a child of God Do so I, I like it, it's a great, it's a great, um You know, it shows a lot of, a lot of, a lot of growth From a character perspective as an artist really It's a good record, but I don't know That's a great song, but it doesn't strike me as a first single. I basically feel like this song says everything we're trying to say in a whole, which is if I let other people just constantly say this is what somebody's looking for, then that means I'm ignoring my own inner feelings and I'm ignoring my fans. So at this point, I can make more records, but the album is already there. It's in the, it's in the CD player. It's not a lot left for me to say. Things didn't go as planned, so we back to square one. But you know what? I'm not tripping, because I know Still Standing says exactly what we need to say. Doesn't matter what the label says or anybody else. With the love of my kids, my family, and most of all, my fans, 
we can win. I'm still standing.